G'day and welcome to the Net Network. My name is Dan. Uh, thanks for watching. Today I want to have a chat to you about uh, Adobe Creative Cloud. I've been a customer now for two months, so I'm in a fair position to be able to review it for you. So today I'm going to give you my top five uh, best things about uh, being a Creative Cloud customer. Number one uh, is trying out the new apps. It's lots of fun. Uh, trying out uh, things that you may have not necessarily had a chance to try out before because you couldn't afford them or because like me I bought the Creative Suite and it didn't come with things like uh, Premiere Pro and, um, and you know, things like that. Um, so I got to try all that out and while I'm on that, the second one uh, was Edge. Uh, the Edge Animate software, I've gotten a lot out of that. Uh, I think it's brilliant software. If you've ever used uh, Flash Pro before, you'll be fine in Edge. Um, it's a great bit of uh, software. It's got a lot of uh, uh, soothsayers out there, people that don't like it, uh, that don't like the way the bits are broken up into different software, and um, a few people, you know, a bit narky about, you know, only working across, you know, very modern browsers. But if you're working with mobile, you're going to love this app. Uh, number three uh, is instant updates. You get everything, once it's updated, it, it, you get a little icon that pops up in your menu bar if that's the way you've got it set up, and you get the update straight away. So any bug fixes or any new features they've been working on, you're gonna get them for your membership every month. Um, the fourth thing that I really like about it, and I say this with trepidation and I encourage you to watch uh, the second video in this series, which is the worst things about being a Creative Cloud customer. Uh, but uh, the fourth thing that I like about uh, being a Creative Cloud customer is uh, the cloud storage and the sharing options that I, that offers. Uh, so I can upload a PSD and share it with someone that doesn't have Photoshop and they can see it uh, fine. Uh, and when the cloud actually comes back online, <laughs> uh, that'll be excellent because I'll be able to save the PSDs into a local folder and it will just automatically update the file uh, in the cloud. But at the moment, that's not working. Please watch my next video. The fifth best thing about being a Creative Cloud customer is the cooler option. So it goes back to the last one. Uh, when you share on uh, share a PSD or a PDF or you know, PNG or an image file basically on Creative Cloud, a little cooler bar pops up and it basically gives you a color palette of what you, uh, of the image that you're displaying or sharing. Uh, and that's brilliant. Uh, I can't say how much I love that. And I can't really put my finger on, I haven't put it into practical application yet, um, but I'm sure I will. I just really like it there. Anyway, that's the best things about being a Creative Cloud customer. Uh, please watch the next video if you've got something out of this, which is the worst things about being a Creative Cloud customer. Uh, this has been the Net Network. My name's Dan. We'll see you soon.